get to this welterweight bout between George St. Pierre and Robbie Lawler. All right, DC, if I pass out, it's because I'm excited. George St. Pierre and Robbie Lawler are now underway. Really as interesting a stylistic matchup as we can put together in this Lawler World Division. How could you not be excited when you got St. Pierre versus Lawler? It was unfortunate that these two timelines barely missed each other, but we finally get them in the octagon tonight. Let's see how this one plays out. St. Pierre's strike attempt there is blocked. How good is that right hand? Looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Oh! Oh! Man! Oh, wow, that happened quickly. Oh, good entry there to take the fight to the grappling realm. Now we'll see what he can do from here, champ. This is exactly where he wants to be. Look for him to try to use ground and pound to open up submission opportunities. All right, relax for you, bud. Go. Three minutes now in round one. Oh, it looks like he's transitioning to an armbar. You cannot stay in the guard of these great jiu-jitsu guys. Attack an armbar. Recognize that when a guy starts to put his feet on your hips, you gotta move him off and you gotta cover. You can't be off to an angle. Looked like a hammer fist from the bottom there by Trigger Saint here. And this might just be a matter of time. Brilliant submission defense there. Side control now, and certainly I would think more offensive options for the bottom fighter than in the half guard. Absolutely more offensive options because now you can just start to get away. You can just oh now trying to isolate an arm DC. He needs to move his hips back to cover. He cannot allow him on that angle. And attack an arm bar. He might get a finish here. Level grappling there. I mean, he had to tap. If he did not tap, this man is not opposed to snapping his arm. Right. Sometimes it's better to live to fight another day, but 